Well, overall, I think we're carrying into 2018 some good momentum that was there in 2017. I think it's fair to say that uh, our initial forecasts for 2017 have been exceeded, certainly in the UK and to a large extent in Europe. Um, we, we, we are, you know, in our view, mid to late cycle, quite clearly. From that perspective, the things that we're, we're, we're keen to sort of ensure we're doing is that we're really looking at the prime core markets. Core markets are always liquid. That's where our client base wants us to invest at the moment. Um, in terms of sectors overall, uh, we're, we're deep across all of the sectors. Uh, we're deep in retail, but we're in the quality end of retail. We're in outlets. We're in prime shopping centres. We're in convenient retail parks in Germany and also across the UK. And they're actually performing well for us at the moment. I think that should continue into 2018. Industrials and logistics in particular as well are, I think, you know, strong markets that should uh, perform uh, into 2018. There's some good momentum in terms of rental growth uh, and uh, the occupied demand supply also actually in check at the moment, which is which is clearly encouraging. So we're pretty optimistic about the industrial sector, retail sector. Uh, from an office perspective, again, we're really focusing on core, uh, dominant, liquid markets uh, all all the way across the kind of gateway cities in in Europe, actually, and indeed looking to uh, manufacture core where the pricing is not meeting the clients um, return aspirations. Across the UK, I think the regional markets uh, are due, um, you know, a fairly a fairly good year. And again, in the core prime in the core prime locations. So if you're buying the best building, uh, or at least in the, in the best pitch in some of the regional centres, whether it's Birmingham, Manchester, or Leeds, you know, I think you should do you should do quite well. And there's an attractive uh, yield premium over um, over risk-free rates in the UK, and certainly in relation to uh, some of the European countries at the moment.